The Pilatus PC-12NG aircraft features numerous tools to help pilots in the flight planning process. One of these tools is the ability to create and edit a secondary flight plan in addition to the flight plan that is currently active. A secondary flight plan can be entered and activated at any time in flight or on the ground. Secondary flight plans can be used to evaluate changes to the active flight plan, change the destination while en route, or to enter the next leg of the trip. In this video, we'll discuss how to create, activate, and store secondary flight plans. In the Flight Management window, click on Flight Plan and select Secondary. Enter the origin and destination. Insert and activate the entry into the secondary flight plan. Activating the origin and destination of the secondary flight plan does not change the active flight plan. Insert the waypoints and procedures for the secondary flight plan and activate. Verify that the last waypoint is the destination airport. The completed and closed secondary flight plan is displayed on the iNav map as a dashed white line. Use the flight plan prompt to return back to the active flight plan. To activate the secondary flight plan, Go to the Flight Management window and select Secondary. Check the Perf Init box to use the existing performance data from the active flight plan in the secondary flight plan. Then insert and activate. Any existing or previous active flight plan information is replaced by the secondary flight plan, which is now the active flight plan. To save a secondary flight plan, it must be named prior to entering any waypoints. A secondary flight plan can be saved in the aircraft custom database for use at a later time. Unsaved flight plans will be lost when the aircraft is powered down. Once a secondary flight plan is entered, click on the Flight Plan tab in the Flight Management window. In the Flight Plan Source drop-down box, select Pilot the cursor will automatically jump to the flight plan name box. Type in the name of the secondary flight plan and push enter. The origin and destination airport will automatically populate based on the entered secondary flight plan. Verify the information and click on save to store the flight plan. Once the flight plan is saved, it will appear in the stored flight plan box. The flight plan is now saved in the custom database and the aircraft can be powered down. When the aircraft is powered back up, the saved flight plan will be shown in the stored flight plan list and can be selected for activation at any time. This has been an overview of secondary flight plans on the Primus Apex equipped Pilatus PC-12NG aircraft. Please refer to the Aircraft Flight Manual for more information.